try this door here. Open this. I don't know what this is. Close it behind us? I don't know what you... Oh god, I broke a coat hanger. They're probably behind me, right? Let me get in this corner and see. Okay, she's right there. Guys, I'm I see oh! you. Okay, we're good. Now, let me start this video off by saying to you guys the word granny. Yeah, I'm talking about that granny that locks you in a room and gives you five days to escape her humble abode. Well, what about if I told you guys that she is back for chapter two? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. The official granny chapter two. And who the freak is that baldy looking? Hold up, the music in the back. You hear that? Dude. We got those Terminator vibes. I mean, she's taken like shotguns. She's got spider pets, no wonder. So what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome to Granny Chapter 2. This is an official second chapter to the original Granny game. And that, guys, is why it's called Granny Chapter 2. <laughs> I saw a load of comments in my video yesterday telling me to check out this Granny Chapter 2, and I figured it was like a fan-made game, but this is the real deal. And apparently now oh, she's oh. got company over. Hey, bro, you use that t-shirt to wipe your butt crack too? <laughs> now, one quick thing. Yes, I'm playing this on the computer, guys, because for some reason, so out for Android right now, and when you try and record on your phone, it doesn't capture sound, at least for me anyway. This is probably going to mean better quality as a result, so if we do like playing it this way, I guess for the next part, because there will be a next part, we'll do the same thing again. So how about you guys go ahead and smash that like button, alright? And then let's hit 20k likes for the next episode, you know what to do. Wait, what the freak? Granny and Grandpa? So there's two difficulty normal, Granny and Grandpa move at normal speed. What the hell? I'm dealing with two antagonists right now. We're going to go difficulty normal, at least for our first try here. Let's skip through, so tip, be quiet. Granny hears everything. Grandpa doesn't hear very well, but he hits hard. <laughs> Press and hold the remove button to free yourself from bear traps. Hide under the beds or in wardrobes. You have five days. Use your headphones for the best experience. Day one. Look at that Slender-esque font right now. Hold up. Make it back up again. How did we end up in this situation, though? For the second time, maybe? Oh, gosh. No idea. Up and arm, soldier. So I can pretty much play this the same way anyway. Most of the controls are mapped out, but... Dude, hold up. Am I hearing something? It's like a clock ticking. All right, let's open the door. Hello? Anyone nearby? I can hear so much movement. What the freak? Am I safe down here? They must be upstairs. I can hear two lots of footsteps, which does make sense. That's like a security camera there. And what the freak is this? Uh, I need a hand wheel. This back room here. It's like a little podium. Something probably does spawn there occasionally. Now, we can duck and hide. No, we can't duck and hide under there, okay? I heard something move. That was not me, right? Uh, check that. I don't know what they're doing upstairs. Are they cooking food? I hear like a microwave beep. Granny and Grandma! Now, this ain't about to be so bad if so, you know, like, what are you cooking? Cooking here. Uh, Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna close that door. So yeah, Granny and Grandpa are in some weird stuff in their free time. We don't judge around here, guys. We allow them to be who they want to be, all right? Go down here. Do I crouch? What? Um... Dude, we got a bow down here. The sewer gate is locked, and there is definitely another monster down there. No doubt one of Granny and Grandpa's dirty offspring. <laughs> all right, let's go back upstairs a second. Hold up. Crouch. I don't know if there's anyone nearby at all, dude. It looks like... This is our only way up, but there's no hiding spots at all down here. I can't break the camera. It's red, so that might mean it's potentially deactivated. But this right here, guys, this must be our way up. We crouch when we go up. Dude, if they see my forehead straight out the bat, my forehead is gone, first of all. Dude, Shorty sees me! Hold up! Where the freak can I go? Can I, like, rodeo around here? Oh, no, I'm just going here. Okay, where's she coming from? Maybe she lost me. Let me see, let me see. Oh, she saw me again. Okay, right, I gotta move, dude. All right, we go this way. Nope. Holy crap, now that was rapid, right? I don't know if there's a way to run in this game. There's no way to map the controls so I can. We're in day two already. I'm limping like heck. I'm gonna actually make a move straight away. Feels like this is pretty much the only way I can get going with this. So let's open this. All right. What the freak? A stun gun. Oh -ho! Whoa! Hold up, how do I shoot him? Um, nice shot. My dude hit me straight in the forehead with a crowbar. Dude, I'm restarting this hold up. All right, guys, I moved things around a little bit, so now we can really pick up the pace when it comes to, uh, I guess, getting around. What is that? Crowbar, maybe? Let's pick this up. Hold up. Okay, yo, don't be hitting off stuff. How are we supposed to escape two of them, though, right? It's like, it gives you the option for one or the other, but maybe the game knows having both at the same time is like a whole new layer of difficulty. Like, how are you going to do this on that insanity thing, man? What the freak was that? That might have been that door there. I have no idea. You know what? I'm actually gonna go in the freaky deaky room right now. So, what is this? We have a switch. I mean, I could get in there and throw something at that, right? Might be a quick way out of this mess, you know what I'm saying? All right, guys, we're not gonna take ourselves out. Reluctantly on this occasion. Let's go up here. No one's here this time. Dude, maybe we have more of a chance than we just see. If I'm quick, I can at least see what is going on. So, we have the crowbar. Let's see, what's here? 
Oh, there's Granny, there's Granny. I kind of want to see if I can outrun her, you know? I should stay in time. Oh boy, hold up, hold up, hold up. No one's there, no one's there. Oh, Granny's right behind me. I gotta move, dude. Come on, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. I have no idea how close she's behind me. I gotta go back downstairs, man. It's like, this is the only safe point. Come on, come on. All right, now I gotta flank him around this or something. I don't really know what else to do, man. Just Oh my god, she's coming up! Go the other way, go the other way. Go, 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 go. Dude, they are so quick in the normal mode. This is insane. Is that day two good stuff already? All right, drop the crowbar just down here there, sir. Give me that good stuff. Now, we've got to get obsessed. Dude, the fact that there's both of them patrolling right now, it makes it almost impossible to get around. Hold on. I see you. Dude, look at that moldy old crusty forehead looking like a potato. He doesn't see me, so we hold out a second. Then we make a move, right? You know, playing this on the computer is kind of a whole new level. Honey. What did he say, honey? My dude, your voice box is so crusty. It's gone demonic. <laughs> She's still got that crusty old laugh too, man. Both of them so crusty together. It's disgusting. It's gross. Come on. All right, guys. I even got a chance right now. So Granny's going upstairs. She's still in the bedroom, dude. Okay. So with her upstairs, let me see. Let's try this door here. Open this. Don't know what this is. Close it behind us. I don't know what he... Oh god, I broke a coat hanger. Dude, I gotta go. I gotta go. So, they're probably behind me, right? Let me get in this corner and see. Okay, she's right there. So, run around the table. Round the- She's got me. She'll come. If I make it downstairs, give her the loop de loop around the corner. We should be- Floorboard's croaking too, but we should be good. Cut her up, cut her up, cut her up. She's literally right behind me. Hold up, let me see, let me see. She's right though. We rodeo around, and then we make our way back upstairs and hope that grandpa is nowhere nearby. I gotta go upstairs. There's nowhere else I can physically go. Granny is so close by. All right, let's try and go this way here, this way. It's a bathroom. Close that. Can we hide? Can we hide? Can we hide? Get in, get in. Is this a hiding spot? Look at the filth on this. Look, this is the problem with these two people. They're trying to clean, but still look at them. That guy's sounding like Father Christmas right now. So, this must be the shower system. This, I guess, might be a hiding spot with some allowance of allowing us to see through. All right, so I'm trying to think how we could play this. I do feel like it's two separate experiences with this one being the ultimate with them both chasing us down. Grandpa doesn't hear, but hits really hard and is a lot quicker than Granny. Granny hears every single floorboard croak. So they've both got the quirks. Together, guys, they are literally the dream team. Just like this All right, please don't croak. This looks like tiling. Do not croak like wood, okay? Close the this gives us some... Maybe she hears the door. The footsteps in this game were always so difficult to judge from. This house just makes it sound like they're always one step away. Let's take a look around here. So, down. Oh my god! Let's open this. Okay, well, I mean, they ain't got nothing to keep their dental stuff in check, which does make sense, you know. Look at their faces. I desperately want to get upstairs. Hang on. Open the door. Granny's nowhere nearby. So, we got books here. This one looking different. Slendrina. It's a dark Oh god! Yo, my guy, what the freak is going on? There's so much movement behind me, right? Go this way here, go this way here. Close the door, close the door. Let's see that. So, it's a spark plug in the bottom there. What could we use that for? I'm thinking there. Okay, so if we close the top two but leave that bottom one open, that tells us there's something there. Also this here. I need a safe key. One thing I'm noticing about this house, though, is there's less routes to try and escape them, you know? We had the basement that was like a key game mechanic you had to use to get around Granny. Not in this one, though. At least not to my knowledge. So, there was a lot of movement when I pulled out the Slendrina book. And look, we can see elements of Slendrina still right there. You know what? we got to find these floorboard croaks, so there's nothing in front there. Ooh, a little hidey spot. You see this? Let's check this out. So, dude... They give us a shotgun. I need the weapon key. Look at that. Sword off shotgun with two bullets, though. Stand up. No floorboard croaks here. Let's try and lift this up. We can. Okay. Maybe they heard that. Oh, they definitely heard that one. Okay. Oh, God. He definitely... He's a very quick dude, right? For an old man, my guy can shift. So, we're into here. Yeah, he can't get... Dude, he looks like he's in medieval armor. Look at that crap. Bro, I'd smash you in the kneecap with this thing if I could. You're lucky. Granny. Want to play hide and seek? Talk. So, my guy's that way. <laughs> Granny sounds like she's right there. I've got it. I can't just, like, hide, though. I've been doing this for, like, ten minutes. Ooh, she's also gone up there. You know, we've got this we never checked out, right? Let her do her thing. Let's go over here. So, open this. What do we got? What do we got? Ah, uh, nothing. Yo, nice artwork. What the freak is that? Look at these guys, man. Vain as heck putting themselves around the house. What? We're going upstairs. We're going upstairs. So, there is a microwave here. Look at this wooded floor, man. So many spots to creak on. All right, let me see if there's a hiding spot here. Okay, there's not, but we've got some cutting pliers. Oh. This is lovely. Nice. It's lovely. Listen, I have no idea. Let me just see. Okay. Oh, she sees me. Run. Run. We've got to go back into the cubby hole. I see you. Oh, the other dude sees us too. Come on, come on. Knock that over. Break this place down. All right, under here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Clean up again. Woo! Wait, clock? 
can open the clock. All right. We've got to learn all this, man. Hmm, let's see this way. Nothing there. Look at this thing, by the way. That's the... That's the way up. Close the door. It's interesting, though. They've literally electronically trapped the place, right? Guys, I've been... Oh, oh! shoot! The force of the crowbar connecting with the cheek on my face. I'm dead. Guys, it's day three, and we've got nothing done. Are they there? They're not. You know, I'm gonna make a straight break for it upstairs, dude. I gotta see what's up here, so give me the item first. Come on, give me that. The crow. She's there! My gosh, if I run into Grandpa, I'm dead right now, guys. Straight back out, straight back out. Granny knows I'm there. Granny knows I'm right there. Keep running, keep running, keep running. Is he? Okay, he's not there. Go in here, go in here. Closest, 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 closest. Okay, can we hide under here? Let's go. Woo! Now we're finally upstairs somewhat. It's gonna be very difficult to maneuver up here, but this... She's screaming that, dude. She has no idea. Bro, you come near me. I'll swap your feet with a crowbar, you know what I'm saying? Let's open this. It's another hiding spot. We've got a vent system here. Look at this right now, dude. This here. Can we open this? We can't. We've got to probably unscrew this with a screwdriver. This maybe we find a way through on the other side and then we kick it through. Wait, that would give us a cut through point. So, we've got to make it to the other side of the upstairs here to get there. Okay, we didn't open the door slowly, man. We swung that thing open around here at least a little bit. Right here. So we move these boxes out of the right. You. you gotta move, you gotta move! Oh my god, I've got no way of getting around this guy. Oh, look at that, both of them chasing me down. Okay, uh, dude, close the windows, close, close, close. Okay, now hide in here. Hide, hide, hide. Oh, they definitely saw it. So they're inside one another. Right, man. Day four. <laughs> Blood clouding my vision right now. You know we're not doing well. But why are they capturing us and putting us back down in the basement? These dudes inspired by Saw quite clearly. Guys, I just tried going upstairs. I'm so done, man. There's no work. This is so difficult with two. This is literally the most difficult thing. The last day already. All right, guys, Granny's chasing me. I gotta go. I see you. This is impossible. With two of them, they are everywhere at the same time. So what's the ending for this, right? They've taken us out. That's what the trap was for. Look at them together. Oh my gosh, we know what's about to happen. She nods yes. He's gonna flip the switch. Yes. Oh my God. <laughs> that is so difficult, seriously. All right, skip this, man. Look, I'm gonna try this just a little bit. I don't think I'm actually gonna get any further, but I wanna see if I can put two and two together. So this time around, we're only playing with Granny following us. I don't wanna deal with Grandpa at the same time. Like, nah, man, we find this instantly, a door lock. So I picked that up. The only way now is to drop it, I suppose, to rid it. I'm wondering, like, if I drop it in here, though, can I trick Granny into going in her own contraption, you know? I'm actually gonna try it, so if I drop that here, Q. That's a lot of noise, that's a lot of noise. Now, I gotta find somewhere suitable to hide. <laughs> Hang on, let me try this again. I feel like this is actually gonna work for whatever reason. So we drop that in there. All right, now, I gotta move. She's always gonna go to the origin of noise, right? I gotta see when she goes in. I'm gonna stand here. Maybe she's coming. She's still running, definitely. She goes, she's going in, she's going in, she's going in. Beautiful. Right, now let me stand up. Come on. I press the button, right? I press the button, let me see. So press that. Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness. Well, that's one way to get it done. Okay, nothing in there. Listen, I know all the spots to search. Okay, a boat key. Boat key, we also need that, definitely. That'll be the last thing we need, so we'll leave that there. We need to find a spark plug and definitely some fuel. Inside the clock, nothing there. Check out the bathroom real quick. Oh my god. All right, guys, check all downstairs. There's nothing here. This gives us a little bit more time to figure out this room here for a cut-through point, nice and quick. So we have to remove this. This is kind of difficult, right? Because that's pretty close to the wall. There we go. There we go. That removes them. So now we can go into here. We've got some cutting pliers. That's going to be for some electrical device then. Okay, we can push that up. There we go. We have our cut-through point. Nice. She's awake now. We can hear her running. She's going to come straight in this room here. There we go. She sees nothing other than the pushed-over vent. Get your crusty bunions out of here, seriously. Listen, we'll leave the cutting pliers there again. Let's check around. This room at least somewhat. Okay, close that door. <laughs> Creepy laugh, dude. I hope she doesn't come back in here. Really, really hope not. Open this. Nothing in there. I'm just basically checking this out, dude. There's no way I'm getting this beat today. So we need the boat key, the boat fuel. Then we also need the spark plug and then something to move the gate. Oh, I see that gown right there. Is she gonna move? Oh, there we go. Okay, she saw me too. This is fine because we're just gonna stay here. And then she's gonna have to back off. But hopefully she goes downstairs. She's definitely going down. Okay, now's our chance then. So I gotta figure out also where these floorboards might creak, you know? Yeah. Security? Uh, what are they hiding away in here, though? You know, security? Interesting. What's this room? Yeah. Security room right there. Let's close that. Now, if we press the button, let me see. 
Fuck it. Dude, there's some FNAF ball crap. Hang on, what is this button here? Press that. We can switch. What? So we can look around the house to, I guess, make our plan. Wait, so we know she's downstairs then with that one. That's a cool mechanic, so we can kind of, like, follow where they're at. Oh, they're still here. What is this? Okay. Outside? At least it sounds like it. We ain't outside, Chief. What the freak is this? Okay, in here, what is this? A weapon key. Oh, so we could get the weapon. Wait, there's a grate down there. It's like an escape route, maybe? Nothing in there. We've got to find the rest of the stuff, though, so... Looking for maybe the spark plug? It's not the spark plug, but we've got the safe key. Hello, guys. I'm gonna drop this here. Bring my attention up here, then I'll take this. Now, this part should let us drop down here. Okay, we're gonna try this, so... We jump down. That fell down. Look at this in here. The gasoline. This is all adding up. I don't think she... No, she's not even interested. All right. A boat steering wheel. That, too. So we've pretty much found all of the components now. We'll use this. Now we have the shotgun and one of the ammo. Okay, we're gonna take her out with this, dude. Okay, she's coming up close, she's coming up close. We'll wait for her to stand really still, okay? Here we go, here we go. Shoot! Boom! One minute 30. Okay, now we keep this here. Let's try and get as much done for the boat as we can. So boat steering wheel, first thing. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna drop them all here. I'm gonna, like, make a storage. We could probably get, like, at least three of the things we need. We know also where the gasoline is, but we don't know where the spark plug is. Get the freak out of my way, Granny, what the heck? Throw that there, too. That's two. So, what else was there? There was the safe key upstairs, and I think we could probably use that to unlock that. And that might have the spark plug in there. What up, microphone? Okay, hand wheel. What? Am I, like, in too deep right now? I don't really understand what else I'm looking for. Granny's back, granny's back. Okay, close that. Look, it's really easy, though, to keep her at bay, so we'll unlock this. That's what we're... Okay, she knows we're here. We may as well run. From what direction? From what direction? Gotta see this, gotta see this. Okay, she's there. So, if I move this way now, I should be able to get around. But that's the third thing, though, for the boat. Shotgun up. Okay, here we go. Shoot. She's gone again. Football minute 30, so we'll drop this. Now, what was the hand wheel for? That was important. Okay, boat key there. Now, next thing, we'll get the spark plug. You know, I might use these four items. I feel like that might be enough. Spark plug as well. Give me that. You know what? One more time for good luck. <laughs> the wheel was right there. We've got five items then for the boat, and they're all down in the basement. I feel like this was a great strap, man. Okay, let's start with the hand wheel. See, is there a location for this? Maybe on the wall or something? Let's see. Wait, the hand wheel was upstairs, wasn't it? This is straight. This is it. Okay, hand wheel right there. Then use it, right? Turn that once. Okay, now let's start kitting the rest of the boat out. That was definitely to open the gate, though, for the escape. Let me see. The gate's still closed, though. Hmm. We'll work with this. Okay, we've got the steering wheel. Let's keep bringing the items down. Maybe I've got to turn the hand wheel again, perhaps? No, look, it was a one-time interaction, so we did what we needed to do with it. Gasoline up next, so start fueling this. There we go. Granny shouldn't hear this either. Nice and quietly does it. And I think we are all good. Now, we're gonna have to drop this. That is kind of annoying. So here's what we're gonna do. We'll drop it behind here. Then we're gonna run straight downstairs. So drop that. Give me the spark plug. Spark plug. Okay, so we've got fuel. What else might we need? We've got the boat thing as well. The gate is still closed. Maybe it will open once we use the boat key. Okay, guys, we're taking the boat key. Nothing more down here. This is all the stuff I collected together then. So we'll try this and we'll see if it works out. Hop on the boat. So where does the key go for this thing? Unless maybe we just start this up. Okay, click it. I can't start the boat yet. Well, why not? Try and use this one here. There's a, a padlock key. Is that for the basement? Okay, well, I've dropped that. Oh, God, she's gonna hear that. Dude, I gotta go. Now, I can get the escape thing down there, but the padlock key, I think that was where the boat was, maybe? Oh, God, I'm dead, dude. That's fine. You know what? I'm gonna drop the padlock key there. That's fine. I think that was only day two. I've made so much progress. This is crazy. Give me the padlock key. I think, yeah, this is for down here. And I think I've put the boat key very close by, in fact. Padlock key right there. And that opens up. Pull the lever. So, that's for the grate. Okay, now, I'm gonna drop that in the water. I hope she didn't hear. She po Oh, she definitely heard that, dude. Right, I gotta try and remember now. Where did I put the boat key? Once I know that, we can escape. Crap. What did I do with the boat key? Wait, it's in the room just to the side of her, if I remember correct. She's gonna go all the way down. All right, now, if I open this, let me just see. Is the boat key in here somewhere? Oh, crap, where did I put it? No, come on. Wait, there it is, boat key. Okay, so close this door. Wait in this corner. When we hear her go past, that should be it, right? Wait. She's definitely coming up the stairs. So we hold out just a little bit longer. This is how we can make the escape. Dude, we're breaking out. Second attempt, are you kidding me? Nearly a tiny obstacle. Now, Granny, don't come in here because that, that would actually suck. It sounds like she's over there somewhere. I'm gonna wait. Thank you for glitching through the wall and confirming, Granny. It's time, guys. It is time. Let's make the break for it. This could be it. Hop on the boat. Okay, now, if we start the engine, because that's open. Yo, give me the prop. And it's done. This is it. We're breaking out on the boat. Woo! She looks so disappointed. Let me see. 
took so much. What are you gonna tell Grubs, huh? Well, Steve, we we'll to get the Grubs so you let me escape. The end. So that's one possible escape of two, and I'm kind of interested to do Grandpa's route a little bit more. Guys, we came. We conquered. Yeah, that was Granny Chapter 2. Playing this on the computer as well, that was a really cool experience with the, uh, I guess, emulator instead of playing it on the phone. I like this one, you know. At first, I thought the house layout was a little bit too complex, but when you're playing just one of the characters instead of both, it does make a little bit more sense, and the mechanics are just as they were before, so it plays well. Guys, if you want the next episode where we go ahead and try and escape through the door, take on Grandpa, both at the same time, I think you know exactly what to do. However, if you did enjoy this video, guys, why not drop me that like rating? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, if you did enjoy, and I will, of course, see you on the next one.